It's been two years since the first case of COVID was confirmed in our area, and it's been a long haul for healthcare professionals. Newswatch 16's Courtney Harrison spoke with a doctor in Wayne County about what he's learned over those two long years. It was two years ago that COVID first appeared in our area, a positive case in Wayne County. Dr. James Cruz is the chief medical officer for Wayne Memorial Community Health Centers. He didn't expect that case to be the first of many to overwhelm the hospital in the early months. Simply the number of people admitted to the hospital, uh, delayed admissions for other things, people be in the, uh, waiting in the waiting room for hours, sending people home you normally would admit to the hospital because you didn't have any hospital beds. I think that was, that, had a, that was one of the biggest things we saw here. Dr. Cruz says there have been many challenges since then, testing, vaccines, and a lot of misinformation. But some good things came out of those challenges. The move to more telehealth and to more innovative ways of delivering health care, I think is really beneficial. Uh, and during this process, we started a telehealth at a program, I guess a nurse mediated telehealth program where we send an RN out to the home. Despite the fact that it's been two years since the first case of COVID in Wayne County, Dr. Cruz says they're not ready to declare victory on the pandemic just yet, as they're still concerned about the number of cases currently. We're still not low. And I think people forget that because we came off of such a brutal, such a high peak that it feels like, oh, it's over, but it's not really. We're still seeing cases. We are still seeing deaths from COVID. They're a lot better than they were a month or two ago, but they're st it's still really occurring. Dr. Cruz anticipates new strains that could cause another spike. And just like all of us, he hopes the pandemic comes to an end soon, so we aren't marking any more pandemic anniversaries. Courtney Harrison, Newswatch 16, Wayne County.